Quadden Bayless is not dead. The nine year old Australian bullying victim who went viral in February 2020 became the victim of a death hoax shortly after he became an inspirational story across the world. The most significant piece of evidence demonstrating that Quadden is alive, and, well is the fact the, t his mother, Yara Gabalis, made a Facebook post warning that there was a death hoax doing the rounds. Earlier in February 2020, Yaraka posted a heartbreaking video showing her son crying over the bullying he received due to H, is dwarfism. During the video, Bayless cries repeatedly and says that he wants to kill himself saying, give me a knife. I want to kill myself the video reverberated around the world with celebrities telling Bayless so, F their admiration for him. A fundraiser to send the family to Disneyland received nearly five lakh dollars in donations. Yaraka Bayless has said that the family would not use the money for a vacation but rather would g, I have the cash to charity. Yaraka told N, I, T, V, what kid wouldn't want to go to Disneyland, especially if you have lived Quaden's life. To escape to anywhere that is fun that doesn't remind him of his day-to-day -day challenges. But my sister said you know what, let's get back to the real issue. This little fella has been bullied. As the video of Bayless spread across the world, unfounded rumors appeared that Bayless was an actor and was in actuality 18 years old. Nopes noted in their debunking of the myth that Bayless had previously been in the media in his Y, Alf. The piece said that if Bayless was 18 now, it would mean that he 13 when the above news interview aired in 2015. In 2014, The Week published a list of hoax sites. They included Empire News, The National Report, Huzzlers, Daily Current, and Freewood Post. The website noted that occasionally news stories from satire sites such as The Onion and Clickhole, are circulated as legitimate news. The Week article concludes simply that users should, take 30 seconds to determine whether something is real before you blast it out to hundreds of, people, We'll all have a better internet for it.